Stage one, clear a week in your schedule and stick to it. This has been by far the hardest part for us because even though I'm a stay-at-home parent and my job is here around the house, I still do like to get out of the house. It helps with my mental health, health to get out of the house. So even though when there's errands to be run, bills to be paid, even if it's errands that my husband could do on his own, I still like to go with him sometimes to do these errands because being a stay-at-home parent and being here all the time just feels overwhelming to me and for my mental health I like to get out so staying home and sticking to the schedule this has been the hardest part for us one of the hardest parts stage one get your child naked and stay close <laughs> Now, my, pro my child has no problem running around naked, and I have heard that this is one of the ways that has worked for other parents. Um, my husband's aunt, my child's great aunt, said this is how she got her little boy, he's grown now, but this is how she got him potty trained when he was little. Um... And she didn't do this with her daughter because she's a little boy and a little girl. and So she didn't do it with a little girl, but before she was born, um, that's how she probably trained her son. We've tried this and he has no problem running around in the nude. But I don't want him like running outside on the porch in the nude. We were just gonna try that earlier and... <laughs> Um, he walked out this, on the porch. His daddy told him to go get a pull up on. So he's got one of the Cocoa Melon Rascal Plus friends pull ups back on. When they look like they need to go put them on the potty, this one. When he was smaller, he had these faces he would make. And I could tell when he needed to go. But now he's bigger and he doesn't really make those faces. So I don't really know when he has to go. And unless he's like wiggling around and looks like maybe he needs to pee. Um, he doesn't make the faces like he made as an infant where I was I was able to tell more when he was smaller. And he's running all over the place. And I can't really tell when he needs to go. Stage 2. Loose clothes but no undies. We haven't tried that. Um... Well, yeah, that's what I was doing a while ago. He had a shirt on with no undies. Let your child schedule. Learn your child's schedule. Every hour is normal. Use prompts, but no pressure. Remind him or her to use that the potty is nearby, but don't force them to use it. Stage 3. Before you leave the house and when you arrive at your destination, take them to use the potty. Combine the potty reminders as part of a list to do next. Stage four, get your child used to wearing underwear. We've tried this. Encourage your child to tell you when he or she needs to go. We're working on that and celebrate potty events. Here we have, as you can see, our potty chart where he gets a sticker for a beat. Ask to use the bathroom, sit on the potty, do his business, help to flush, wash and dried hands, stay dry all night. It's still a work in progress for us. This is my first child. So it's still a work in progress for me. If you have any tips, you can comment on below. These are all from last time. I didn't decide to later in the day when I realized that we weren't going anywhere today that we'll try potty training again. Okay. Around 2 o'clock, I changed his wet pull up. He refused to go to the potty. 2 30, I got him to go to the potty. Around 3 and 3.30, we were outside. 
wait. Take a start it around. Yes. One o'clock when I decided that we were going to do potty training today. He went to the potty. I got him to pee pee in the potty. Um, the one thirty we walked over to get some food from his nanas. Um, at two o'clock he refused to go to the potty. And then at two thirty I got him to go to the potty. And then we're off and on outside all day long. 4.30 when his daddy was getting ready to go to work. Changed to pull up. I got him to go to the potty. Um, back outside. I can pull him in to get him to go to the potty. As soon as he woke up today, straight out the door. Dustin put a pull up, headed over to his nana's, played in the water hose. I think I got him to go inside her place for a little bit. Um, come back outside, play in the water hose some more. Went in it, then we ended up eating on the porch. Come in for a few minutes, back outside. So I opened on all day. We were home, but we were outside, and I couldn't get him to come in the house long enough to to go to the party. So today was pretty unsuccessful. Um, these are from last time. This one's from today. Seven thirty. I got him to pee in the party. And then I had to take Isaac to the party around 10.30. He was already in bed. Or asleep on the floor. He fell asleep playing on the floor. So today, all in all, was pretty unsuccessful. We finally did have a whole day where we stayed home. And it should have been more of a successful day. But with it being summertime and they wanting to play outside... I couldn't get him pulled inside long enough to go to the party.